And welcome back, guys. Welcome back, folks. Welcome back to yeah, Undertale. Me, yeah, me playing Undertale. Apparently, there's a some boss sort of looking. Well, the, this is the the way this 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 goes is you get one section of the game, then a boss, mm -hmm. and then another section of the game, then that area's boss. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, I've uh, fiddled with the controller bindings to so suit, it actually makes suit your sense. Needs. Yes. Anyway, do you smell that? Surprise! It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. That sounds delicious. It's what I is. want pie now. <laughs> Damn you! I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on small on, on snail pie for no, they said small pie for tonight. Here, yeah, I have another surprise for you. Okay. This is it. Is this my room? A room of your own. I hope you like it. Ah. <laughs> is something burning? <laughs> Make yourself at home. Run away. Alright, so, um, with this, to get the items she gives you, you have to go to sleep. And it, it's a re it's one of the best health items, mm -hmm. but you only ever get one of it. Mm. But if you don't go to sleep, you actually end up not getting it. In that case, <laughs> I'll just jump on the bed. Oh my god, is that a, is that a... It's a slice of pie. A slice of pie. A slice but, of... No, if you open your menu, this is the best thing is. I'm going to items. Oh, it's, uh, it literally says, on some points it says, Butts Pie. So, uh, yeah, in, you know the fight menu, it literally just said, Butts Pie. <laughs> okay. So. Ooh, there's a note on the door. Room, Room under, under renovations. renovations. It's you! No, it isn't. It's my character. It's Toriel's diary. Read the circle passage? No. <laughs> Definitely bigger than a twin sized bed. Yes, this is a goat man sized bed. Or a goat woman. Oh, yeah, goat, goat, yeah. It's goat mama, I remember. Good point. Water sausage. <laughs> okay. I always thought oh. there were those weird things you don't open the Tom and Jerry cans that were very sausages. <gasps> it's Toriel's sock drawer. Scandalous. Scandalous. Cactus, quick, give it a hug. Truly must. Sundere of plants. Yes, anyway. Damn it, I kind of. I, I wish I hadn't looked at that diary because now I kind of want to go read it. It's up to you. It, might, it, it, might get... it, it doesn't affect anything in the game. Oh, in that case, I'll go read it. I was worried it might get some like bad stuff. Just a re <laughs> That's not a regular bucket. Of snails. No. It's Toriel's diary. Read the circled passage? Yes. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Why? Because she was feeling bonely. The, the jokes of a similar caliber. Yes, be one. This is where my, my puns. This is where your puns well, come from. My 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 what my puns were uh, inspired by. A lot of them come from. The history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated far, far, far in, into the earth. Uh, we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named Home. Oh. That makes sense. Wait for it. As great as our king is, he's pretty lousy in names. <laughs> yeah. The, the end of the tools being found out to make them safer. I've already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favourite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you. But I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Not really. I mean, anyone can be anything they want, apparently. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? No. You have, you, you have to press the uh, when can I go home to progress the story, otherwise... But I, that sounds so mean! You, you said, well, you can, you can go around, but... I'm you... gonna go exploring a bit, and then I'll be then I'll go be mean to the goat person. Some white fur stuck in the drain. Oh. Ooh, is that the rest of the pie? The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat. <laughs> Bull! I, I am intimidated by no pie. Lions? Yes. Pies? The stuff no. Top of it. Must use fire magic instead. That's cheating. Well, a lot, as you, a lot of so a lot of the attacks by monsters are literally magic, really. Yeah. Most of them. 
There is a brand name chocolate bar in the mm. fridge. Which brand? I'm curious. Yeah, but notice how it's brand named. Like, as in, it says from the uh, surface, but how mm. did it get here? Yeah. To the cellar. Oop. Or maybe not. I think you should play upstairs instead. Fine then. Since you're going to be like that, I'll come and be mean to you. <laughs> Do you want to hear about the book I am reading? It has got 72 uses for snails. How about it? Um, how to exit the ruins. Um, how about an exciting snail fact? Make terrible... I never would have guessed. Interesting. I have to do something. Stay here. Run away. This basically triggers the events that... Uh... So have you guessed who the boss is yet? Mr. Ketchup. No. The ketchup drinker. No. Is it Torio? Yeah. Okay. Do I go into the... Yeah, that, that's why that's why she kept putting up the basement. You'll find out more story here. Is the dead babies? No. Good. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you! I am only protecting you. Do you understand? No. Go to your room. No. Do not try and stop me. This is your final warning. You want to leave so badly? Hm. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. And boss fight. Now again, you can still spare her, but mm. there, there's a unique way of doing it. You, it doesn't require acting. So, do you remember uh, when one of the the, when the frogs was telling me about sparing, like, may, say, you know, sparing somebody, just saying you don't want to fight, maybe you'll have to yeah. do a name when someone's yeah, name isn't yellow. Mm -hmm. This is what it's referencing, basically. So I, I do have to. Well, if you if you want to spare her uh, and this one, because it took me about an hour to figure it out. So like, why is nothing happening? Mm -hmm. You just have to keep pressing spare until until the battle ends. If you want to fight it, you can as well. What the hell is that? It's her hand with uh, fire magic. Um, um, I was going to say you can't actually die in it, well, you won't actually fully kill you. You'll okay. get to like 2 HP and you'll start seeing stuff avoiding you. I won't, like, uh, people are probably going to be annoyed I'm telling you this, but it's just because the book's probably is, like I said, it's a rare it's item. It's the best item in the best It's food. the best healing, one of the best healing items, and you'll never get it again. So if you, if you do it now, wait for it, you'll notice that they're all avoiding you. Yeah. You can still technically die, but that's only if you... you if you if you try. Yes. What am I proving this way? I'm proving that I'm not going to kill you. Because you're a nice old goat lady person thing. Like really. You no. can see why it took me a while to figure out this the first time. Yes. Like, why? I wonder why, why, how can I do this? Stop it. No, I'm just going to stand here repeatedly. And just, you know, sort of... Stop looking at me that way. No. I'll look at you exactly that way. <laughs> Keep in mind though, um, some of the later bosses will kill you. Yeah. But, but in this case, this is... Yeah. I know you want to go home, but... Please, go upstairs now. I promise I'll take good care of you here. I know we don't have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? 
I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. So it's basically saying, as soon as you go through the glass door, you can't go back into okay. the ruins. Most of the rest of the area game, you can still backtrack and come back, but this but area, at this point, no. No, not until so. you finish one of the all the way to the end of the, one of the mm. endings. Can I go back to the room and yeah. sleep and restore? Oh, and... that didn't restore your health. Oh. You can go back to a safe point and do that though. Okay, because I should probably I get the I should probably do that given that I'm on two HP. Mm, yes, probably. And there's a save point right outside the house, isn't there? Mm-hmm. In the next area, you'll come to a shop where you can buy more health items as well, as well as, um... One thing I missed last episode is, um, you actually missed an... You know in the, the crack... the six crack holes? Yeah. There was an item that would give you better defence. No. Oh. But, um, I was trying not to basically spoil stuff here. Yeah. I mean, that's not really spoiling. spoiler. I was going to say, that, that, that spoiling item finding, that's not the same as spoiling a plot. And to be fair, you've got, uh, when it comes to this point, but, but I always saw it was pointless because it was only really good for s selling later on. You can only use one mm. shot to sell it anyway. Because you get uh, the uh, the next uh, defense item anyway. Okay. But, like, every area has got, like, a, a weapon, uh, you know, like, hanging around and yeah. a defense item. But you mean, like, that toy knife? Mm-hmm. And it would have been the faded ribbon this time. Okay. That's a ridiculously long. Oh, here we go again. Is that? That's Flowey. Clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? Yes. In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you're able to play by your own rules. You've spared the life of a single person. And a whole load of frogs and stuff. <laughs> I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? Run away. Trip them up. You'll die and you'll die and you'll die. Until you tire out of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Maybe. Or will you give up entirely in this world? I don't know. And let me inherit the power to control it. No way are you getting your hands on my controller. I am the prince of this world's future. No, you're not. You're an overactive sunflower. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. Okay. This is so much more interesting. I don't know. Regicide's pretty interesting. Um... The... <laughs> And he's gone. Okay. Yeah. Flowey does kind of follow you throughout the game, but you don't always see it, and it's not until towards the end of the game you see him really. Well, look, a title with. screen. Okay. Uh, yes. Games made by all of one person. Yeah. There's a camera hidden in the bushes. bushes. Uh, okay then. Why is there a camera? That will that'll make more sense later on in the game. And why do I appear to be walking through a forest? Because you. I can. thought I was underground. Yeah, it's. I never got the sense of this. It's a tough looking branch. It's too heavy to pick up. And. Rubbish. A thing happened. Yeah, that that's not the only thing that'll happen. Yep. There appears to be something following me. Yep. Oh no. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Hello. Turn Maybe around. Give him a hug. And shake my hand. Um, how do I shake it to the hand? Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah, so what about that jacket now? The old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, 
You're a human, right? Yes. That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans is a skeleton. Comic Sans? I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. Is that why there's the camera in the bush? No, not okay. yet. But, you know, I don't really care about catching anybody. Good. Now my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. Uh-oh. I have an idea. Go for this gate thingy. Yeah, go right for it. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anybody. Okay. Quick, you have a convenient seat mom. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Um. What's up, bro? You know what's up, brother. It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring on the slab. And it's really cool. You wanna look? No! I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one! I will capture a human! Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect! Recognition! I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard! People will ask to be my friend? I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. That sounds weird. Hmm. Maybe this lab will help you. Sans! You are not helping, you lazy bones! All you do is sit and boondoggle! You get lazier and lazier every day! Hey, take it easy! I got a ton of work done today! A skeleton! <laughs> <laughs> Was that really a brunch? I just heard. Yeah. Sans! Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it! S Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Whoa, sounds like you're really working yourself. To the bone? Down to the bone? <laughs> Ugh. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more... Backbone into it. <laughs> now I'm gonna to say to you guys, I've been wanting to voice Sans for ages. <laughs> hmm. Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. You might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. How terrifying! Yeah, it ain't won't do it now. It's some sort of checkpoint. But there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Hang on. I assume those aren't... No. Those, they don't what I always found funny is that that's Sansa station. Mm -hmm. Actually, hey. I hate to bother you, but can I ask you a favour? I was thinking. My brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry. He's not dangerous. Oh, really? Even if he tries to be. <laughs> Aww. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. He says before walking. Ah. The wrong way. Ooh, safe point. Yeah. So what I find funny is how Sanders says this station is really the convenience that the line still holds your determination. Okay, so that box uh, you can put stuff in, and it's got. Uh, I think it's got the next weapon item. Didn't see the box level. Use the box? Yes. So... Ooh, a tough glove. That's the next weapon arm. So, if you want, you can uh, put the pie in there for safekeeping, because I like you can get some help items in the town. Yeah. I just realised, you didn't actually equip the toy knife. No, you I didn't. didn't. Oh, God. You like... It's a teen comedian. Made pretty much. You make a bad ice fun. Ha! <laughs> nice try! Heard it because it's in the cat crowd. Um. Attack 12, defend 7. This team comedian fights to get me. Let not snowflake out! Uh. Snowdrake is smiling at his ice bun. You laugh at Snowdrake's bun. See? Laughs? That was wrong! Snowdrake is pleased with its cool joke. Oh good, I can spell. Yay! Oh, no. 
Now then. And you can completely abuse the save function to get your health back. I equip the tough glove. Hang. Oh, good grief. What? Tough yeah. glove? Yeah. I did say this game's very punny. Yes. I'm in a pun. I'm punny. Ice cap struts into view. That has a great hat. Envious. Envious, too bad. Okay, fine, then I'll insult you or something. Oh, you could just ignore like, oh. Well, I could try. I could try stealing his, his <laughs> nice hat. Yeah. Well, it's, well, yeah. Steal. You tried steal our skate cap hat, but it's, it's not, not weakened weak enough. Oh, so I need to punch it a few times. No, no, no. You just need to get it off guard, so. Ignore. Hello, my hat over here. Uh, nice cap is secretly checking if you're looking at his hat. Well, in that case, steal. You try to see if I was cap, but it's not weakened enough. No. Hell, fashion, please. You can get well, not not steal his hat. You can grab his hat, but you need to like keep. Mm. Run away! Need more. Need health. Need health. And the convenience of that still fills you with determination. What's up? Ooh. <gasps> fishing! So it's fishing a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Yes. All that's attached to it, the end of a photo is a photo of a weed local longsmith. Call me! Here's my number! <laughs> you just like not to call. That'll make more sense when you go into another area. Okay. Is that, um, he just walked that way? Yeah. So. Yeah, that, there's a. Do I get an explanation? Not so, really. as I was saying about Undyne. I'll put it pretty much, he can use, he can more or less teleport, some, some people say. There's a big theory about it. Um. I saw it, he goes. Sands! Oh my god! Is that a human? Run away! Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh! Hey, what's that in front of the rock? <laughs> oh my god! Is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sounds! I finally did it! Undyne will... I'm gonna... I'll be so popular! <clears throat> human! You shall not pass this area! I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, I'm not sure what's next. Hmm. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye so it out for you. You can't say I didn't warn you. No, you did warn me. Oh, uh, yeah, so you know how Sanders, Sanders station was yeah. really nice? Is that... That's <laughs> No, just read what he says. As soon as I... run away from this. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you wonder? You wonder. I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. Nope, not yet. A, <laughs> not yet a very famous royal guardsman. Oh, well. You can also tell who's who's from the font because yeah. they the virus font or something. Absolutely no moving. Oh, oh. No, keep going. Is that? Oh my Did dog! Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, the human, I make sure it never moves again. Doggo. Doggo, my. God. Right, um, there's uh, a little thing I need to teach you quickly because the game okay. kind of screws you over by telling you after the screen. If an attack's blue, stay still and it won't uh, harm you. Okay. Because, again, this is one of the things where the beginner's trap. Check. Usually excited by movement, hobbies include squirrels. Squirrels! Squirrels! Don't move an inch! You mean like that? Better. Don't go and catch him to find anything. Okay. I kind of want to do that. Go for it. 
<laughs> pet dog. What? What? I've been pet. Pat 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 pat. Pat 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 pat. Dog has been pet. This is another one I was doing inside the bedroom. S something pet me. Something that's not moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Quick, go away. You can bug him as well. Someone's been smoking dog treats. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Hello? Is anybody there? Nope. You can't see, you can only see things when things yeah. come, so that's all Joe. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother is a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so much in a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. <laughs> Which is what, you know, that's why I was just explaining that then, because mm -hmm. otherwise you'd be like, why am I continuously dying? North, ice, south, ice, west, ice. East, Stony Town. Okay. And ice. Yeah, so, east to the town. Okay. You're so lazy! You were napping all night! I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses. Oh ho! The human arrives! In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you'll find this one quite shocking. Electricity puzzle. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze! When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Possibly. Because the amount of fun you'll probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. <laughs> okay. Sans, what did you do? I think a human has to hold you. Oh, okay. Um, did he just... <laughs> yes, he did. <laughs> Hold this, please. Okay, fine then. Gimme. Um, <laughs> I have to be balancing on top of my head. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily. Too easily. But well, you did give me the solution, so... However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother, Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> Did he just fly away backwards? He more or less moonwalk. There's a part where he spins out. Of the hey, oh, you don't understand. By the way, thanks for thanks. My brother seems to be having a lot of fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't that really cool? Yes. Yeah, I know, it's well, the end of it. Yeah, and uh, so it's yeah no, I, I was going to say, I just kind of want to go see what's... Snowman! Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I can't move. If you'd be so kind, traveler, please. <coughs> Take the piece from me and bring it very far away. Sure. So, you can take a piece of it and it's a health item, or uh, you can choose to keep all of it. I got the snowman piece. Which is uh, another good health item, but you can choose not to consume it because he wants it to, because then you're consuming him. Heals 45, please take this to <coughs> the ends of the earth. I think that's another one of those really, really good ones. Next 45 butts, HP. Butts pie. Mm. <laughs> but. Mm. Oh, you oh my god, it's a... Rabbit. I don't understand why these aren't silly. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer! Hey, would you like some ice cream? It's, it's the, the frozen treat that warms your heart. Nice cream, just 15G. I'll get some nice cream. Here's a super duper day! Show me the nice cream. Heals 15. Instead of a joke, the rapper says something nice. That's pretty good, actually. Are you relieved about that? Yes. 
Oh my god, it's a... A snowball. Yes. And there's Sans. So... I see what's going on here. Mm -hmm. Do you? I have to get that snowball into that hole. It's an optional thing. It looks like a snowball, actually. It's a snow... No decahedron. Yeah, yeah. It's got, got roughly the right, the right amount of sides. No. Right, it gets smaller as you go. You get a green flag. Green, your concern and care for ball led you to a delicious victory. You're awarded 1G. Oh, for that, gives you money. 1G. Yeah, because you got took so many hits to get in. I've been thinking about soul trees too. Want some fries? No, it's just 5G. Now, if you, if you say no, it'll come, but if you can keep pressing ba five, it'll just like. Did I say 5G? I meant 50G. Really? How about 5,000G? 50,000G, that's my fun offer. What? You don't have the money? Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. Ooh. His. Smell danger rating. Snow smell. Snow bun? White rating. Can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy blue. Blue rating. Smell of yellow rolling around. Weed smell. Humans. Green rating. Destroy at all costs. Why is the green yes, red? Don't ask. Hers. But that's a clue for the, for one of the minibusters that's coming up. His and hers. Oh. Or the or the or the rating thing. Yeah. So. Smell danger. Snow is white. Can become yellow. Unsuspicious. Puppy rating. smells of rolling around. Humans. Red, green and red writing destroy all costs. Okay. So as, as a lot of um, the story is uh, they a lot of monsters want to kill you for your soul. Ah, human! I hope you're ready for. Sands, where's the puzzle? Just right there on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Okay. A word search. You can literally just skip over it and then press it again, and then it, you can just go away from it. Yeah, fancy go. As and you can see, monsters and skeleton. And. I was going to say, and the entire t first line. Yeah. Anyway. Sans, that didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have used the crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude? That easy peasy word scramble? That's a baby bones. Unbelievable! Human! Solve this dispute! I'm not sure what Jumble is. You know, like, um, anagrams. Oh! Word scramble. Baseless word scramble, look. Well, jumble, definitely, then. I can't... I can't anagram. I don't know why. <laughs> yes! Human must be very intelligent! If they also find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> um... Yeah. I'm sure you were supposed to be capturing me, I was just saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday, he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Okay. Hmm. Ooh. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. Little do you know, the spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed again by the great Papyrus. Okay. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to, to eat up the spaghetti. spaghetti. <laughs> it tells you with determination. As you know, it's yeah, I was going to say, I, I, I was gonna say, that looks like a microwave. Take your frozen spaghetti. It's so cold it's stuck to the table. Right, go oh. to the microwave, you'll find this. It's an unplugged, unplugged microwave. microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> can I? You, no, you can't oh. do all that, unfortunately. There's a lot of. Uh, the mouse shows up a lot of times throughout the game. I was going to say, I thought the mouse. I thought, I thought, I thought I saw a mouse hold. Unplugged microwave. All microwave. Well, the settings say spaghetti. Very well. Ooh, sign. Warning Dog marriage. 
that's the reference to the minibus. Okay, as in the, the puppies rolling around? Oh. Lesser dog appears. Oh, you like this. Oh, shit. Right. So if you if you pop Lesser dog, just first patting him. Um, Betting him. Just press it I was gonna say, any specific? You barely lift your hand, unless the dog kicks up. No, it's not. No, that that's not the best part. Oh. Just do it, keep doing it. You can spare it, but just keep doing it. It is. Did you just get taller? His head goes. It can literally go off screen and all the way back down. <laughs> Um, yeah. <laughs> raises its head up to meet your hand. <laughs> it was a good dog. I mean, you can spare it. It only takes one you can spare it. But it's also like gives you like a little Easter egg later for how you know. At least the dog's obviously been like for how many times you've done it. It's just, I think it's the next screen on the screen after. That's Excitement knows no bounds! Excitement. <laughs> okay, you want to be careful now. I know. Critical pet! Don't do something crazy. Unless the dog is overstimulated. You have to jump up to get the dog. <laughs> Motor revving. You don't even pet it, it gets more insane. Okay. No way to stop this madness. <laughs> Madness. This is Lesser Dog! <laughs> you call it up but it's too late, it cannot hear you. It actually does come down as well if you keep going. You mean like that? Yeah. You can oh my god, it's Long Cat. Then. Or Long Dog. Wields a stone dagger made of pomegranate. Oh. Really? You pet Lesser Dog. So this is... It goes through the text box. So it's possible that like, you may have a problem. It's possible. <laughs> no, it'll just say the same thing. But it literally go, it can go all the way further down. That's a dog is lowering. Underneath the menu, and I'm pretty sure it comes back out. You know, from out, out behind the text box. Okay, well... I'm not certain. Lots less than dog is unprintable. <laughs> but I appreciate the sentiment. sentiment. So you are, I, 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 I again, I don't fully know, but I'm pretty sure it can come. That's the dog is whining because it can't see anything. <laughs> Keep going. I'm better. Well, would appreciate the sentiment. <laughs> whining because it can't see anything. Or probably whining because it can't see you. Yeah, that's it. it appreciates the attempt. Like I said, I'm not fully sure if it does it. Well. We'll probably find out in, in maybe three more. If I'm seeing its growth speed right. Yeah, no, I don't think it's. Oh, nope, that! Ears! I spy ears! I can't believe I'm just sat here doing this. Yeah, I, of I, thought, I thought that when I discovered it, like, I, did, I never got that far though. Like, eventually, like, perhaps mankind was not meant to pet this much. Oh well. It continues. it continues! Hello there! It continues. Oh, good grief. It's questioning your, your choices. choices. I'm not surprised, given that I've... Um, I'm about to extend it off the screen. Oh, does it, will it turn around? I don't know. I've never seen that. I've Let's seen it turn around. find out. If so, I don't know if it, it does. Yeah, but you said you never got it this far before. I know, so. but I, I've never seen anybody else get it this far either. Hooray! Achievement get. Further than anyone else has ever seen him get it. Really? Yes, really. Really? Mm, I, I get the feeling it's not going to turn around. Let's see what the text says now. Really? No, no the lesser, when it says lesser dog this, lesser dog that. Pan, pan. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Lesser dog, dog has gone, gone where no dog, dog has gone, gone before. before. I feel like we should get an achievement for that. 
you do, Where no dog has gone before. Is, 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 the, is there no achievements? No. I don't think it's anything else after, after I this. I think we've reached the end of the program. Yeah. In which case, let's spare it. <laughs> and just like... 60 gold, though. Um, what am I... It's a... It's a, it's a, it's a map? It's a, yes. X marks the spot. Okay, it's a map of this area. You are right. So, X is... There. Yes, you're right. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. And now we can get further on. Good. Uh, maybe not get distracted by Doggo. <laughs> oh, we've already passed Doggo. Doggy can't see you. Uh, the minibus time. The... Grim... The, the executioner dog? What's that smell? What is that smell? If you're a smell... Identify yourself. Okay then. Hmm. Hmm. Here's a weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Dog eye. This is the dog bar. So uh, they're husband and wife, more or less. And your health is low. Dogami. Dog. Dog. Dogami. Don't look at me. I didn't make the game. No, you're just the one that says that. No, you should play this. Oh, good. I'm, I'm noticing something else. Yeah, they are after kissing. They're, they're... No, that's not what I'm noticing. What? Have you ever heard of a, a board game called Munchkin? No, I haven't. Well, the first expansion for it is called Unnatural Axe, right? Okay. And featuring on the box are an axe very similar to oh, the ones they're dear. holding. Maybe, maybe that's a reference to that. Yes. Part, that's not your husband, okay? Oops. Death count equals one. Game over. You cannot give up yes. Just shit. Rewind! Stay determined! Okay. I am determined. Oh, there's You've a gotta go for a lesson. <laughs> oh, we know what it does now though, yeah. so I we, mean Yeah, now we can avoid petting the extreme dog. There, so you, yeah. So pet it. Yeah. And you've got full health again now, so... Yes. Now, if only I could... Hang on. Now, I can spare him instantly. But you don't get as much gold. Oh, well. There's a switch hidden here. Put the switch. Now, go back to the save point. Yeah. Restore my health. And prepare for a boss fight. Well, a mini-boss. Yeah. There's only one, two, three... Six, well, technically there are fifteen to sixteen bosses, but so, but there's only five or six in in one play f okay. through. Okay. Because, like I said, there's a few types of play playthroughs, so we've gone for this. I was gonna say I've heard there's several types of playthroughs. Even I've, even I've heard that. Mm. Identify your smell. Oh. There's there's multiple endings, but there's uh, let me think one two there's technically four play types of playthroughs. Okay. Okay. Now I have to. Um... Uh, so do you remember when the uh, thing said about the um, smells? Yes. Do you remember exactly what it said? Red smell. The, the the blue. Was it green? Green in red writing. That's a human. Is that Remember human? The, the clue it gave you with uh, puppies. Roll around. Yeah. You, you smell, smell like a weird puppy. Let's kick human tail. Do human have tails? Well, the, the white ones can still hurt you. Yeah, I know. Still, that's blue smell. So if you re-sniff, I'll sniff you again. After rolling around in the dirt, you smell oh, alright. Right. What? Are you actually a little puppy? They're still. Ooh. 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 You might want to heal. My no scream. Don't touch my hot dog. He means me. <laughs> Oh! Right, so if you go left, okay, and then you can just dodge right. That's right. So now, what would you do to a dog? Pet. Mm -hmm. 
some of these are like when you know how to them are really easy, but if you don't know anything about the game, it, it can be really, really a pain in the back side. Yeah. So then the other one? No, you can oh. pet the yeah. And You pet dog me. Well I've pet by another foot, please it I don't know what happened there, you weren't moving in front of oh. what I saw. Okay, you're going to be all right. Rewind. Rewind, stay determined. Where did the, um, sorry if I'm, if I'm messing around for it, I'm looking for the easy button we had. Oh, um, the easy button should be on the desk, on the other desk somewhere. Oh, yeah. So, again, like I said, if you need it, Easy. And then I'll take over. Hmm. Yes, I will hand these to you. So right. Please. Uh, what I will ask you is, are you wanting to spare or? I want to spare them. Right. Okay. I want to go with all the spariness. So if uh, you ever come to an enemy that's a bit difficult, so I'm I'm just waiting for um. Waiting for dog. And why did I say the switch? Stuck? Because you haven't fought me, dog. Ice cap and Jerry. Jerry. Everybody hates Jerry. Jerry's like you know, Jerry, Jerry's pretty much the character of Jerry. It's that one person that's annoying as hell, and everybody just ditches them. Hmm. So you literally have an option to go, Jerry, ditch. You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when he looks away. <laughs> Snow, no, it's hat residue. Okay. Everyone wants to celebrate that Jerry's gone. So, we, I, do you want me to let you get you to steal his hat? Yes. So you managed to tell your eyes. Uh, it looks yeah. annoying. Hello, my hat's up here. Mm -hmm. mm. The thing is, if you don't, if you don't quick enough, Jerry comes back. Then the, the dog's not going to be coming back because remember we did the dog and switched oh, we said the same. That's why the switch. You continue. It, it seems defeated. And there's Jerry. So you're not used Jerry to doesn't attack. attack, but return of Jerry. So, uh, steal. steal. You tried to steal Ice Cap's hat and I succeeded in melting your hand. Aww. What's the point? This is the end of Ice Cap, and now Ice Cap is no more. This okay. Is cap. Now it's just ice. Okay, that explains the, Literally. Uh, the cube. Okay, and Jerry. So we ditched Jerry. Yeah, the other one says j ditch Jerry. What's the point? Yay! 35G. Yeah, the thing is, Jerry's randomized. Jerry can appear anywhere in the game. And mm. it's annoying. Because you can't... Jerry doesn't do any attacks, he just keeps the turn to keep, you know, going and going and going. Yeah. And literally, the only way to get to get, to get rid of him, you can't mm. spare him, you just have to ditch him. Because you need to check. It's just because it's a, it's a group chat. Oh. It's a group chat. Oh, it's called group chat. Here's that weird smell. Mix. Eliminate you. Oh, no, we don't want to do that. So, do this. You smell like a weird puppy. No. This, for some reason, on your um, controller, it keeps accidentally like, pressing up. Oh. Hmm. Now, that's bad of mine, but... You notice, like, they're, when they're actually together, it looks like yeah. a heart as well. Dogs might have been disbanded. There you go. Yay! Mm -hmm. Dogs can pet other dogs. A new the world is open up for us. Thanks, Thanks weird puppy. puppy. Oh. Well, I have a feeling when it comes to one of the I'm going to the safe thingy. One of the um, later um, if runs, you know, the really hard run where um, mm -hmm. certain enemies are unlocked. Then I'm going to be doing that a lot because those are really hard. Yeah. I've only done them once. That's why we have the button. Mm. Mm. Okay, we've got X 
boxes, turn, turn every hex into, into an hour, then, then press the switch. And there's Papyrus. I was going to say, I thought that looked like Pappy. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you what? sell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Do you want to be nice? Oh, do you want to go well, I, 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 just, I, want to, I want to be nice, but I'm not sure which would be the nicest to say. I mean, if I tell him I ate it, then I'll go, Oh, good, you liked my spaghetti. But if I tell him I left it, he might go, Oh, good, you left me some. See which one? Left it. Really? It is an evil way. Wowee! You resisted the flavor of my home cooked pasta. Just so you could share it with me? The eruption, it literally me. goes, You're the first person who has actually enjoyed my cooking. <laughs> Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> yeah. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> Ooh. Human! Hmm, how do I see this? You are taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow flows to the ground. Now the solution is different. And, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. Ding, 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 ding. I suppose what I'm saying is... Worry not. We said we'd do the area, I mean... Oh yeah, of course. Uh, I, the Great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. We're not that far off the town as well. If you want to, if you okay. like, because it's good. You get to the town and then it's the next boss fight. So if you want to do it like that as well. Yeah. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll, I'll try not to give away the answer. You don't know the answer. There is a cheat to this. To be fair, there's a very, very big cheat, but I'm not going to tell you what it is unless you really need it. Oh, we just moved. I don't, you, you, so, you. I've just that was cool. I've never just seen that before. You were in Papyrus's. Um, you know, spawn place. Yeah. No, you've, now you've got to press the switch to reset it. Okay. Hmm. Doesn't, doesn't, doesn't this remind you of the, um, shall we say, Pokemon <laughs> stuff where you have to do something like this? Yeah, like the, the like, um, that gym. Oh. Final gym of Ruby and Sapphire. Yeah, well, yeah. The, 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 the cracked it. ice floors. Yeah. Right? Oh, <laughs> damn. That was a pain. Yeah, I much preferred the sliding ice floor in Mahogany Town and Silver and yeah. Crystal. I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. <laughs> oh, hey. Good job of solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Hmm. Hey! It's the human! You're going to love this puzzle! It was made by the great Dr. Alphys! You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color! Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute. Yeah, and green tiles are alarm tiles. When you step on them, you'll have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. Who my favourite? They will make you smell delicious. Will me smelling delicious have any effect? Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. Let's slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Kind of. Yeah, I think so. 
And there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. And even I will know the solution. <laughs> Get ready. Okay. Fortress of Perpetual Pain! Not even I can get into it! Seriously, I think I left the keys somewhere. Um... Your puzzle appears to be broken. You can watch it. <laughs> so I just spent all yeah, the time... Yeah, no, that's, that's one of the things of it. Uh, yeah, literally. Mm. Actually, the spaghetti from earlier wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he gives it up, next year he'll even make something edible. The machine isn't working. Yeah, I can tell. <gasps> Dog! So, um, you know when you keep... If you uh, keep putting letters on, you end up with all these like, broken, mm -hmm. long-necked dog statues. And that's what that Easter egg is. Because it, the, there's a guy who said, there was a dog that ran and came excitedly. And it was, for, look, with huge inspiration, he kept like building and building and building it, and mm -hmm. it broke. Oh yeah, that's the next. Aware oh, of dog. Please pet dog. It's a clue to the next kind of. Dog is staring next. blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into So if you keep petting him, that's the end. It'd get like make a really long yeah. dog and it break. No, the dog will never get up trying to make the perfect snow dog. It fills you with determination. Okay. That guy would just pretty much say stuff. I don't consider itself an artist, but doesn't ever know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. Oh, you're mean. <laughs> uh, I don't know what that character name is. I don't think it has a name. Elk person. Oh, is this? Yes. Oops. This is a combination of. Did I just? It's so a lump of sand with the word sand written on it in red marker. And this is. It's a snow papyrus. Yes. Oh, it's a mahog it's, it's mahogany town gym. That's what I'm saying. This is a combination of both. Oops. Hey, I never knew you could do go diagonal. You found out a different solution. Oh no, you haven't. No, I haven't. I know the solution to this one. It's over. Because you you've got to end up in the centre one, so you can slide across yeah. the bottom. Yeah. As such, you go up and across and down and across and across and down. And across and up and across. But and I didn't up. actually know you could go diagonal. There's probably another solution that way. Um. And you have a stone in your head. Oh, a snow stone. A heap of snow. Ooh, dog! It's a tiny, tiny dog. dog house. Woof! Woof. Hmm. Uh, is that a dog? He's so fuzzy. Da. Oh. Uh, Meet the how? Greater dog. It's a great dog. Can I pet it? Yeah, yeah. Well, you have to. You have to go to do a few stuff first. But you, you get, you'll get it. I think. This one killed me the first time when I played it. To be fair. Great dog inches closer. Well, I've never seen that one before. That's creepy as hell. I've not seen that sprite before. Great dog just wants affection. I've never seen that sprite. That that's creepy. Oh, it's so excited. Ba ba ba. Patting the drum with its front paws. Play! You make a snowball for the dog pit. It splats on the ground. Great dog picks up all the snow in the air and brings it to you. <laughs> now dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Great dog wants some TLC. Tender level. Yeah. So... Pet. It sits its entire weight onto you. The movement's slow. But... You still haven't pet enough. Just be careful here, because you're not nearly getting dead as well. I know. Pet keeps us past at least 40%. Hey! Don't put so much legs hanging in the air. 
I should have bought more more nice queens. Do you know what's funny? That's the one how I died in the first ring as well, exactly towards the end of it. I think rewind. Be determined. No, I'm determined. I'd make some sort of committed joke, but that'd just be mean. Hmm. Um. So, if you want, do you want to leave it here for now? Yeah. Mm. And we'll pick up the next episode. Yeah. It fills you with determination. So. Okay. Well. So, yeah, this has been Undertale. Played by me. I'm still a bit confused. You're getting into it, though. You're yeah. starting to get how it works. I'm just glad I finally got to my sons. Yeah. I was going to say... Most of what I know about Undertale and Sans has been because he's been on about Sans ever since. Geeking out. I've, yeah, uh, to be fair, I've not spoiled anything with Storyline. No, you know, you just, just uh, like, yeah, except for the obvious bits like Ketchup. With, with Sans, it's a very complex character, and he's, 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 it, the way to think of it is a soft spoken skeleton who knows mm -hmm. more than he lets on. The morality of man is not a simple structure, it has layers of complexity. Uh, anyway, um, this has been Undertale Part 2. Yep. We'll see you in the next part. Um, yep, I'm Rewind. I've been here. And I'm gone. See ya.